If you want to protect your network, you deploy a firewall. But what happens if that same firewall leads to exploits? Stay tuned as we analyze CVE 2024-3400, a perfect 10 critical vulnerability. We will provide some Yara rules in the article below, as well as the indicator of compromise and workaround while the patch is being released and expected on the 14th of April. This vulnerability is easy to exploit with root access to the firewall and injection characteristics can open the door to downloading more malware. Palo Alto a perfect 10 out of 10 on the CVSS score. In the end of the video, we communicate the timeline, workaround, and how to address this vulnerability at the scale. CVE 2024-3400 is a zero-day exploit that affects Palo Alto Network's firewalls. It is a vulnerability within the Global Protect feature of the PAN OS, the operating system for Palo Alto firewalls. Specifically, it's an unauthenticated remote code execution vulnerability, meaning it can allow attackers to remotely execute arbitrary code with root privileges on vulnerable systems. No user interaction or authentication required. Currently, there are 912 exposes, Palo Alto network firewalls distributed between United States 181, India 101, China 62, but more are exposed in the internal network. This vulnerability is particularly dangerous because it grants attackers the potential to gain full control over the firewall. Imagine the doors that could open, sensitive data exfiltrated, networks compromised, and security measures bypassed in the blink of an eye. CVE 2024-3400 affects specific versions of Pan OS 10.2, 11.0, and 11.1. It targets systems where both the Global Protect Gateway and Device Telemetry features are enabled. There are several mitigations for those systems explained at the end of this video. Check the article in the comment for the latest news. Let's walk through the timeline of discovery and understand why this vulnerability is a ticking time bomb. March 26, 2024. The first successful exploitation attempts occur. April 10, 2024, Velexity identifies active exploitation and notifies Palo Alto Networks. April 14, 2024, the date by which patches are expected to be released. The gap between the discovery and the patch release is a window of opportunity for attackers. This makes CVE 2024-3400 an immediate and pressing danger. Phoenix Security comes to the rescue with the Advanced Identification of Systems, the Unified Risk-Based Vulnerability Management Platform with ASPM module can help you identify, remediate, and act on the system more exposed. Import vulnerabilities or scan your system externally, leveraging the external attack surface algorithms to pinpoint all instances of the affected PanOS versions. 10.2, 11.0, and 11.1 its deep integration capabilities enable it to interface with existing network architectures seamlessly, providing a comprehensive audit of systems using the Global Protect Gateway with device telemetry features enabled. Once the affected systems are identified, Phoenix orchestrates a remediation campaign by deploying the necessary patches and workarounds across the network. With Phoenix Security, you can trace and determine which system is mitigated and protected by the workaround. In the meantime, a workaround is released. For Palo Alto customers with a threat prevention subscription, there is a lifeline. By enabling Threat ID 95187, which was introduced in Applications and Threats Content version 8833-8682, attacks utilizing CVE 2024-3400 can be blocked. It is crucial to ensure that vulnerability protection is configured correctly on your Global Protect interfaces. Visit the blog in the comment to verify if you are vulnerable, which version is vulnerable, and how to track remediation campaigns with Phoenix. If the threat prevention mitigation isn't an option for you right now, you can still protect yourself by disabling device telemetry. This is a temporary measure to hold the line until your device can be updated to a fixed version of PanOS. Instructions for disabling telemetry can be found in the official PanOS documentation. In conclusion, CV 2024-3400 has triggered a fast response, perform mitigation as suggested, apply patch when is released on the 14th of April, and track remediation action. Phoenix, fix vulnerabilities today before attackers exploit them tomorrow.